Hi, I'm Jenna. As we look at the new features for Chief Architect X10, we've added several new editing tools that should improve your productivity. Let's begin by looking at our CAD snapping improvements. You will find that visual snap indicators now only show for relevant snap points. Furthermore, snapping now has priority over object bumping, so you should find that snapping is now easier and more straightforward. To improve visual feedback when editing objects, the selected edge now has an improved highlight to help identify the object's active edge. A new Stretch CAD tool is available to make modifications faster for your CAD work. You can create more natural-looking distributed regions and garden beds by introducing variations in the spacing, orientation, and scaling options for a more natural look. And you can now convert polylines to distribution regions or paths for added ease and flexibility in creating these objects. Symbols can now be rotated in 3D using the newly available edit handles for the selected object. It is now faster to edit multiple defaults simultaneously. To make a change for all doors, such as casing, all door defaults can be group selected and then quickly changed. You will find this works for most defaults, like text and dimensions. The Delete Objects tool has been enabled in 3D views. You can use this tool to remove components in your design. And of course, you can continue to use this tool from the 2D plan view. Terrains include automatic cutouts, such as those created for your house footprint. There is a tool to convert these auto-terrain holes, so they can be manually edited. There are several great new features added to Chief Architect X10 that you can expect to see in early 2018. And remember, all new software purchases include free upgrades for the first year. So if you're not currently a customer, get started today with Chief Architect.